YouTube, welcome to the, welcome back to the Gunsdale Vice City Definitive Edition playthrough. Today, Tommy is going to be helping out Kent Paul with Love Fist and also Big Mitch Baker because, because you can only do like one or two of the Love Fist missions before you can, I think you can only do one Love Fist mission before you had to do the biker missions. <coughs> So we'll do one Lufus mission and then do the biker missions, which the biker missions can be a bit of a pain in the butt, especially if you went out of the M60 ammo. And I have to wait 30 seconds before going in there because they could be um, cussing within the first 30 seconds of the video. Bad things were happening, but I don't care. Let's get right into the mission. Hey, Tommy! Glad you could make it. Hey, you ever met Love Fist before? No, I haven't, but I've always loved your music. Let me introduce you to the band. This is Per Percy, Dick, and uh, Willie's in the cars here, and that was Jez in the booth earlier. And guys, I want you to meet a good friend of mine. This is Tommy. We go way back. Hey, pal. And, uh, what was your name again? <laughs> Leave it out, Jez, you remember. Lovefest. Don't be Did playing you? them games with me, Did mate. You? I'm too crafty for that sunshine. English. Good See, one America, the, the thing is, Tom, mental, the boys need some help. They ain't too connected here. They don't have the old hands, totally your father. We need some drugs, pal! Gonna get on the old <laughs> love yeah, fest, yeah, nice you know? Yeah! Well, this is Vice City, man. What's the problem? Love juice, man. We need love juice men, can? Love juice? Aye, two parts boom shine, one part trumpet, five fizz bombs, and a litre of petrol. Can you help us out, pal? Oh, we really mean a lot You can do boys. that for the boys, right? Go and collect the love juice. Damn. <clears throat> that cap really turned in front of me like that. Dude! Really? Oh, heck no. Kill the dealer and get the drugs. the girl but well, he literally popped my damn tire is this bike still back here yes it is dude literally popped my damn tire I didn't even see what the mission brief said I'm assuming we gotta pick someone up for love fist But that dude really thought he was going to get away with scamming Tommy. <clears throat> like, you can't whip off Tommy. Nobody whips off Tommy for steady. Which, speaking of, which I did say on stream on Thursday, because <clears throat> it's when we found out, when Rockstar told us on Twitter, R Ray Loyola, the voice actor of Tommy for steady, has sadly passed, so... I took a few days break from this game just so I can properly honor Ray Loretta's work on Vice City as Tommy. Hey Mercedes. Hiya Tommy. And how are you? Just fine. Listen, you fancy having love fist? Okay. But just as a favor, I expect returned. <laughs> So yeah, I basically took the break to appreciate all the work as Tommy that uh, Ray Loretta did. It's a shame that he passed. I don't know what age he was. 
I'm assuming he had to be at least. I'm guessing he was like at least in his 60s. I'm not sure how old he is when they made Vice City. But he did good advice, but he did good voice in Tommy. I will never forget that. I'll never forget him as Tommy. If they try to remake Vice City again and they try to replace Tommy, I'm not playing it because you can't replace Ray Loretta's voice as Tommy. See you later, big boy. Do I have to head back to the Schmolk Shack that I bought a while ago for a mission? That's actually where the uh, where Big, Mc, Big Mitch Baker will be. And then the next part we'll do Phil's missions. That because that's the only way we can buy M60 ammo. <clears throat> And I need to stop by the Malibu Club and the, uh, phone call. How you doing, mate? It's Paolo. <coughs> Look, Tommy, I forgot to mention, we're going to need some extra muscle for the concert. A bit of security. There's a biker gang led by Mitch Baker. It would be great publicity. Very rock and roll, baby. Sort this out for me, and I'll get you some backstage passes for the gig, alright? I don't need backstage passes, so that's the call that we needed, so let's get to it. Oh, I will. That entire cutscene again. I hate having to mute cutscenes in this game. It really does ruin the playthrough, but. Alright, fans and blues, let's see what you can do. What the fuck? What the hell? What was that glitch? What? What is that glitch? What the hell was that glitch? Seriously. Are you kidding me? Yeah, I'm definitely not winning first time. Oh my god. I actually got into fuss. What? <clears throat> I don't remember if I switched back to the default controls. That it came when the game got remastered. Because the default controls are using modern game controls. Using L2 and R2. And... RT and LT if you're on Xbox. PC, same controls as always. <coughs> WASD. Okay, I literally thought I didn't have a chance, but I actually did. <coughs> I 
and I gotta stop at the Malibu Club, and that was just crazy, okay. <laughs> got you again. Hey, Rossetti, Cougar says you can handle a bike pretty good. Yeah, how many more errands am I gonna have to run? I'm a very busy man. If it's a fight that's gonna sell this, then bring it on. Being one of us ain't just about brawling. It's about being part of a family. Yeah, I've been part of a family before, all right? It didn't work out. Yeah, all right, but this family takes care of its own. We don't ask a man to do the dirty work and then let him do 15 years hard time. Yeah, that's right, I've done my homework. This here's the biggest family of misfits, outcasts, and badasses. Hell, some of us have even been betrayed by our own country. I was locked up during Nam Ugly business. Which is why I'm gonna ask you to go mess with the man. This whole damn country needs a kick in the ass, and we're the ones to deliver it. So get out there, grab a bike, and show this city how pissed you are. Another cutscene I'm gonna have to mute. Okay then. No, 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 no. Okay. Um, let me go get some more body armor. And then I'll do the next... Knows about Tommy being in jail for Sonny Forelli because he said he's done his homework. So he's probably watched Weasel News and heard about the Harwood incident in Liberty City. Because everyone knows about the Harwood incident now, even people in Vice City, <clears throat> which means. Mitch probably knows that Tommy is nicknamed the Harwood Butcher. That's because remember, that's where Tommy got set up by Sonny Forelli. <clears throat> ended up killing 11 men that Sonny hired to try and kill Tommy. Because Tommy was a made man in Sonny's fam in the Forelli family, which means if Sonny would have racked Tommy there and then, Sonny would have been looking bad. And he would have been in trouble. But Tommy wouldn't.
Now, mister. How do I get out? Oh my gosh, I didn't have enough, uh... Now the game that basically stole M Mitch's bike was the Sharks. Because the Sharks aren't that powerful anymore. They're doing anything they can to get make money. OW! What kind of SMG were the sharks using then? <clears throat> How do you figure standing there is a good idea? Well, that's the end of the Big Mitch Baker missions. Um, hopefully you guys did enjoy this part of um, Vice City. If you did, please leave a like button. Please hit the like button down below. Subscribe and turn on post notifications because it would also help the channel out. Also, share the video because it will also help the analytics, and I'll see you guys in the next one. I'm going to check up the Facetti State and the Malibu Club, and I'll catch you guys in the next part. Goodbye.